Hi, I'm Coach Rich Rogers, and welcome to the Blue Wave Podcast. In this podcast, we're going to take a look at the Stroke Scorecard. Now, I was going to do the Level 2 podcast today, and then I got down to this section that said they have to score X or Y on the scorecard, and I realized, well, not everybody knows what the scorecard is. So before we go there, let's take a look at this. Right now, I just have opened up the Breaststroke Scorecard. And what this does is it breaks down every stroke into five different facets. One is underwater, second is head positions, then arms, legs, and rhythm. So every stroke has the same thing. And under those, there's five key points. Okay, so for example, with the underwater, is there a long, tight, deep streamline and body position to begin the pullout? So over there, if we take a look at it, a lot of times we record with the uh, kids' phones, and they do a lot of this on their own. They they self or group uh, report and give scores. So if they're doing it totally wrong, they get zero points. If they're doing it really well, they get two points. If they have it kind of, sort of, they get one. And it goes all the way through. And then each section gets a subtotal, which can get up to 50. And then since all of our kids are very familiar with uh, zero to 100, at the possible 50 points, you times it by two and you get your scores. Okay. So this is what the stroke scorecard is. And it's very invaluable to learn every aspect of each one of the strokes and break it down into these things. Each one of these could be a podcast on itself or part of a class, but more on that in another podcast. So this is a quick one, but I just wanted to give you a heads up on what the scorecard looks like and how we're going to use it within our program from the very first time kids are swimming to the time that they're hopefully going off to college and swimming as scholar athletes. So again, I'm Coach Rich Rogers, and thank you for listening.